Hello everyone, it's the Grand Strategy Nerd bringing you another episode of Fascist Mexico. Now I wanted to remind you once again that uh, this is a test here in 1080p. If it goes okay, if you guys say that yes it looks fine, the frame rate droppy things I can deal with, uh, that's cool because we'll keep on doing it then. This is also the last video I have pre-recorded before my week-long trip out to San Diego on business. So... Um, I look forward to creating stuff on a more timely manner uh, in the future. Well, Bolivia fell in the last one, and Peruvian were dicks and took all of the mineral producing region. And I think I might have screwed it over by trying to be too greedy there, but man, I really don't like Peru. I really don't like them. Because now they hold all the tungsten cards, man. And I'm really low. Look at that. I mean, I only need 6 tungsten, but I need 63 steel. Eey. Man. Just, all these other units are so much faster than mine. Mostly because they're not as underpowered as I am. But at least they're gaining territory for me this time. I'm glad that Americans don't really give a sh care about anything down here. <laughs> they're just like, yeah, we'll fight for you. It's all cool. Um, they, they haven't given a lot by the, uh, by the British, though. They gave him part of the southern Bahamas. I'm surprised they didn't give him Belize. But they have Jamaica and the Caymans as well. So. My two little cav units. Just chilling out. I don't know why they're not in Havana. That would make sense, right? Go to Havana. Caballera. Caballeria. Wow. Alright, we're moving here. Americans are just flooding down here. We are still waiting for this one infrastructure upgrade. I didn't even see when it was going to... When is this going to be over? In six days. Six freaking days. Right, but we are steadily producing lots of industry here. That's really what we're focusing on. Hopefully with our logistics company, that will help us out as well. Uh, where are our men? Taking forever to get anywhere. And these guys, they're going everywhere. They don't even know where to go. Yeah, we're all, we're all strewn about. And these guys won't move because there's not enough supply. Which is alright. Man, they're pretty low here. Organization and everything. That's hourly. What? Oh, because the infrastructure is so bad. And they're out of supply. Oh my god. I, I really. F do I need to pull them off the line? How can the infrastructure be this bad? I gotta make my way all the way down to Rio, too, which I don't really like. Alright, how are you getting there? Oh, see, they took it. I knew the Bolivians would start doing this. So basically, I can't control this region because Bolivia still was left a little bit here in San Santa Rosa. I don't know why it's not showing it anymore, but it's here. Santa Cruz. But I don't have enough strength with these units. I'm going to need the Americans to help me. I mean, look at this strength. The strength is so freaking low. I mean, they're almost gone. I should, If I could disband them, I would. But I can't because they're not mine. Oh, I guess I could. I can hold the division, I can't disband them. Go America, get me my Chile. We're taking forever. Such bad supply here in northern South America. At least Americans are having fun going up and down along the, the Mex in Mexico. Many of these men haven't seen Mexico for a long time. I know you can do it, but you can't. You're not going to move because there's no supply. No. Argentina's joined the German Reich. Shit. Well, that's not going to help out the Americans, is it now? Well, who they join? Yeah, the Axis. Okay. Axis. Not the Axis. The Axis. 
So my whole blitz here did not work at all. But at least we got done with that infrastructure. Um, now it's on the La Libertad. I don't know if that alleviated any kind of inf any kind of supply issues. It doesn't look like it. I mean, I have to dismiss it. What, what am I going to do? Oh yeah, naval combat? With my 22 destroyers? Get those Argentinian convoys. <laughs> Whoop. Nope. Of what? Targeting what? Who? I see no Japanese ships. Yo, man, go out here. See what's going on. Are we done? We're not done with this combat yet. Come on, will you just sink them or something? What naval invasion? Why have my planes not done anything about it, too? That's the other question. I see... Well, I want you to... That's convoy rating. Well, where the hell are they? What the hell is that? I'm hearing all sorts of noises. Um, I don't know. That's odd. We got into another fight. Okay. Yeah, you just keep on destroying the the will of the Argentinians. Yeah, go America. You got this. Venezuela is also improving their position, which I don't like. And once again, I am just helping out Peru. God damn it. <laughs> now, who's moving where? You, you stop moving, you go here. How long is it going to take you to get there? 24 days to cross a freaking river. These guys have barely left. Holy crap. Alright, you... They're in such bad supply, though. No, no, no. They're in better supply now. It's like they're getting relieved of supply here. Enemy naval invasions targeting there. Oh, destroyers are having great success out here in the uh, around the Galapagos. We do have a motorized division. Once, uh, once we get done, still want this logistics company done. Yeah, I don't know where anyone is. I don't really want to move the destroyers up from from here in the Pacific because they're doing such a good job of convoy raiding. Uh, 
Well, that's good. We're moving. We're getting there. Uh, they're getting stalled against the Peruvians, against the Bolivians again. Oh, we're attacking for some other reason. That's cool. Uh, they're just they're just Peruvian soldiers. They're not they're not true-blooded Mexicans. So we can let them go. That's fine. Uh, are these what? What is down here? This is considered. I'm not retreating. This mountain. I wonder if I should move. Yeah, but then we're gonna get. Uh, hills. Well, you can leave then, okay? Because if you are too low supply to move, I, I can't use you. Oh, look, here's another one to come join me. Our little destroyer screen. Slowly, ever slowly. Looks like we're fighting back here. The problem is that uh, the Americans are moving, so they keep on expanding the Peruvian borders. Which is not helping my cause out at all. Oh, good. Dispersed industry. Good. So then we can go to ultra dispersed industry. But I'm really just going to do excavation again so we can get eke out just a little bit more resources. And then yes, I know I'm going to have to deal with all this infrastructure in in Brazil, which is going to be horrible. Um Hey guys, how's it going? we have over here so you need to be looking out for Central America alright cool and then right, that's gonna take a long time I guess I can get rid of the Southwest seeing that we've no longer need them Right, what are you guys doing? Are you still running sorties up here? Yeah, I guess so. Ecuador is really helping out. We're doing the best we can. Now, why are they on Ecuador? Oh, that's where this where they're based out of. Okay, so yeah, so we're just running lots of sorties. I would hope that we have air superiority over here, but who knows? Yeah, Americans are kind of stalled again, it looks like. I was like, come on, man, move. Still producing 150 per day of this. Waiting for this to come up, which is taking forever. You know, if I think if I crank this up to five, it's not even going to matter because then it's just going to act like four usually did. No, stop. Stop trying to move everywhere. Oh good, a logistics company's done. So I'm going to connect my camp. Oh, that's all one. 
And they're pretty good strength wise. Organization is crap out here. Anyways, let's look at our makeup now. Hit it. Let's put a logistics company on there. And what at these guys? Oh, they didn't even have a signal company either. Save that. Motorized. You guys need a signal company and a logistic company and how about some motorized infantry vision equipment what are you guys going to use um yeah what, what, let's not use any of the basic stuff cool And do we want engineers? Nah, we'll be alright. Save. Okay. So, start training up. How about three, three of these guys? And we'll set them up in Honduras. And we'll train some motorized. Three of those. And we'll set them up in Costa Rica, in San Jose. And go! Oh yeah, I know you have that. That's cool, buddy. I need you over there. I don't really need to do pork strike. Okay, so now that we have that, we can upgrade it right away. Okay, we're already researching the last one of that. Marines organization. Are we researching recon? No. I kind of feel like we should really focus on the logistics company here. Yes, I know we have insufficient resources. Thank you. All right. Yeah, so all the Americans are doing, they're helping out, but they're taking on Brazil for Venezuela and Peru. Is there is there literally nothing over here? No, it's all here because they're it's gay. I'm sorry, it's not gay. That's that's horrible of me to say. It's just really dumb. Man, we keep on getting in these little skirmishes and crap out here. Very low surprise. Spread out your units. Move away. From, build higher level infrastructure and make sure there are no bottlenecks. Yeah, yeah. Build enough convoys. Oh, I have enough convoys. It's all just crap. Why are you down here again? I thought you were moving. Can I turn off these things? I just want to just want to just trash the whole thing. I just feel like you gotta stop moving people around when I don't want you to. I mean, they are everywhere and nowhere. This is it's Center Kiss, Mexico. So stop moving that way. I understand everyone's in low supply game. What do you want me to do? I'm building up as fast as I can. It just takes forever when you only have six factories I have no idea where this naval invasion is apparently it's coming fall of Warsaw Soviet Soviet armies recently approached Warsaw didn't they already conquer them 
Or they pushed them back. Oh, they finally pushed the Reich back. Now, what the hell does this say? Victory! I managed to sink convoys. Hooray! Hey, little victories here in Mexico. Little victories. All right, so low supply everywhere, not producing planes anymore. As we try to produce mucho grande arms, we have a need. We have a need of sixteen thousand. It's not going very well here from a supply situation, but from a land situation, it's going fine. It's just supplies are are hor horrible. We don't have enough of anything, so. Oh well, that's what we got to deal with. Well everyone, thank you for watching this episode of Fascist Mexico. Like I said, I hope the frame rates were too bad. If they were too bad, let me know and I'll downgrade back down to, uh, to 720p. But um, yeah, thank you for watching. If you like this series and like the video, go ahead and click on that thumbs up. And share it around the internet. And if you have not yet, you can click on that subscribe button. It lets me know that I'm doing a great job and you want to see more videos from me on Grand Strategy Games in the future. I totally messed that up, but uh, that's why you guys watch me, because I'm never perfect. Well, everyone, until next time, good night and good luck.